So hello for the 1500 sub special. I have my hot point 9534 on the right there and the laundry center's 9530 on the left. I'll let you guess what I'm about to do. So before we got started, uh, I'm going to show you show you a few differences between the machines. Um, as you can see here, the 9530 here was released in April of 1980 along with the 9510, uh, 20, 12, 11 and 31 whereas the 9534 came out in April of 1988 so exactly two years later with alongside the 9510, 14 sorry, 24, 19, 33 so as I said, this is Chris's 9530. I'm going to now hand you over to him and he's going to tell you a bit more about his. So this is mine. Um, I got this four or five years ago, maybe from Facebook. It was £5 and it came with the 9310 dryer, which you will have seen as well. Um, they've been together their whole life. I've got the receipt for this when it was new, delivered uh, to the guy where I picked it up from, same address. And it cost the guy £320 in about September 1986. Um, as I said, in its time, I've had it, I've put a new side chip on it. I think I've, I've changed the lid, a few plastic trims here and there. The dial I've sourced an original replacement one. Um, we'll look at differences later, but the six on mine isn't red because it's not got the quick wash that the 9534 has. Um, it will do a quick wash, it is in the manual, um, but it's not written on the fascia. Um, I've also put new bearings in it, new drum spider, new inlet valves, a pedal with the suppressor, and had new brushes and a module as well in that time. Um, but I said it's all working, it's a lovely little machine, um, I'm not sure what I can say about it really. I said it's from 87, 86 and the dryer is dated November 86, uh, so it's two months younger uh, than the washing machine and they were at the same household, so yeah. So again, this is my Hotpoint 9534. Uh, this one was not bought, uh, it was actually found as scrap about 20 years ago at the side of the road originally to be used as a donor machine for my grandma's 9510 I believe it was uh, as it had a leak uh, it turned out this was put into operation um, it needed bearings back then I think it had a new door seal and I think it had something else I can't actually remember um, I've since changed the bearings again about four years ago about something like that three four years yeah. ago uh, and I've sourced a new lid, new front yeah. panel, new door, uh, catch, uh, handle rather. Door trim uh, is a replacement, isn't it? Sorry? Door trim is a replacement. Door trim is a replacement because originally it had a gloss one which was not standard on this model. Um, right. Put new side strips on it and it's had a original knob put on. It did have an original knob, it snapped. I put a second hand one on. The queen one, didn't you? Yeah, it was uh, often three six or something. something like so uh, I found another one of these, uh, and yeah, this is how it's uh, it uh, stands now. It still needs a little bit more work to get it to par, but for now it's operational and yeah, happy with it. Nice one. So let's have a look at the differences. First things first, you'll notice the hot point logo and the error atom is different. Next you'll see that the text is different and on this uh, gloss strip you'll know the Electronic Thousand Plus is not complete capitals whereas on mine it is. Again as we said previously the text on the dial is slightly different there's no quick wash on number six the shower icon is very slightly different and the icons themselves are very slightly smaller, as you'll see. So another difference is you've got the lines top and bottom are also different. So on the 9530 we have a gloss door with a matte catch. Whereas on the 9534A, which is later, we have a complete matte door and catch. So that's the end of this video. So 
from Chris, thank you very much. No worries, thank you for bringing the machine over. No problem, no problem. So the next video you'll see, yes there will be more, you'll see these two wash racing. Um, this was just a differences video as you've seen, a little intro intro introduction as to uh, you know what they're how like the and how, how they're different. So yeah, now you've seen that, you might understand it a bit more if you didn't already know. Uh, catch us in the next video, which won't be long, and we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Bye.